one, do you know what that intro is to? If you know what that intro is, leave it in the comments below. It's my next music upload. I'm so excited. I can't wait to finish the video so you guys can hear it. Hello, my name is Patty Broussard and you have found my music channel. My music channel is all about the Array Umbira. Friday, I answer my viewers' questions about this very unique instrument. Here's today's question. 5Tune215 posted a comment. I also wanted to add, you were the inspiration behind my karimba. I'm thrilled that I inspired you. Thank you so much for sharing that. What are some things you find special about this electric umbira compared to the acoustic? It's been just a little bit over a year that I have had my solid body array. One thing that's very different about the solid body is that the notes linger. They, 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 the tone, when you, when you pluck the tines, and this isn't plugged in right now, but when, when it's plugged in, when you pluck the tines, they linger much longer than the acoustic array. And the sound is just amazing. It's really beautiful. But there are times when I don't want that long lingering sound. One example is Malaguena. So I wouldn't play Malaguena on the solid body because of that linger. I might try it, but I think it needs to be more percussive and more plucky. But then again, there are songs that I play on the solid body that are more appropriate than the acoustic. For instance, um, uh, a pure imagination. It is beautiful and I have a recording of it. I haven't yet made a video. But the linger and the solid body and the song, it just goes together. even plugged in and it's still beautiful. Having it plugged in is top of the world. Another thing I've noticed the difference between the acoustic and the solid body. When I play the acoustic I have to use a little more force with my fingertips to get the sound. <laughs> Yeah, you have to use a little more force and a little more fingernail to get the sound out of the acoustic. <laughs> I love my arrays. Where else, where else can you get something that sounds like that? Beautiful. I love it. And with the solid body, I don't have to use so much pressure from my fingertips or my fingernails. It kind of the sound just goes through and out the uh, input. But, okay, so that's another deal. A little more pressure to play, a little less pressure to play. So that's just a few things that I've noticed the difference between the solid body and the acoustic. I love them both. I, if, uh, if I had to choose between one or the other, I probably couldn't. If I were on a sinking boat and I had to save one, uh, oh, I don't know what I would do. Do they float? It's wood. I don't know. But I'm so grateful that I have both the acoustic and the solid body. So blessed and I just so thankful. Thank you for your question, 5Tune215. If you have a question about the Array Umbira, 
Leave it in the comments below. Every Friday, I will make a video answering your questions. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked this video, give it that thumbs up and please subscribe. I would love to have you as part of my Array family. Take care. So if you've made it to the end of my video, I'm gonna play a little something something for you. It is a little preview of my next music video. I actually play it on the solid body, but right now I'm gonna do a little acoustic just for those of you that have hung around. Thank you.